The laurel leaf has been considered a symbol of victory, honor, and achievement throughout history, and it is often associated with mystical qualities. In ancient Greece, the laurel leaf was sacred to Apollo, the god of music, poetry, and prophecy. It was believed that the laurel tree had the power to inspire prophetic visions and provide protection from evil spirits. The Pythian priestess at Delphi was said to have chewed laurel leaves to induce a trance-like state in which she could prophesize. The Romans also held the laurel leaf in high esteem. They used it to crown their military victors and poets, and it was a symbol of power and prestige. Emperors were often depicted wearing a laurel wreath on their heads as a sign of their authority. In addition to its symbolic meanings, the laurel leaf has also been used in herbal medicine for its various healing properties. It is said to have antiseptic, anti-inflammatory, and digestive benefits, among others. Overall, the laurel leaf's mystical qualities and symbolism have made it a powerful and revered symbol throughout history. Spiritual and Cultural Significance Bay leaves have been used in religious and cultural practices for centuries. In some cultures, burning bay leaves is believed to purify the air and ward off negative energy or spirits. It may also be used as a way to connect with ancestors or invite good luck. When I was a child, my grandmother would often tell me stories of her childhood in the small village of her ancestors. One story, in particular, stood out to me. It was about how her mother would burn laurel leaves in their home to purge negative energy and evil spirits. My grandmother's mother was a wise woman, knowledgeable in the ways of herbal medicine and spiritual practices. She believed that burning laurel leaves had the power to cleanse a home of negative energy and drive away any evil spirits that might be lurking. Whenever my grandmother's mother sensed that something was not quite right in their home, she would light a few laurel leaves in a small brass bowl and let the smoke fill the room. She would then go from room to room, wafting the smoke with a feather to make sure every corner was reached. My grandmother remembers watching in awe as her mother performed this ritual. She would sit quietly, observing the curling smoke and listening to the gentle swish of the feather. As the smoke rose, she could feel the tension and unease in the room dissipating, replaced by a sense of calm and peace. Over time, my grandmother learned to appreciate the power of the laurel leaves. As she grew older, she began to burn them in her own home, whenever she felt overwhelmed by negative energy or troubled by unsettling dreams. Now that my grandmother is gone, I have taken up the tradition of burning laurel leaves in my own home. Whenever I light them, I am reminded of my grandmother's stories and the powerful connection between generations. And as the smoke curls up toward the ceiling, I can feel my worries and fears falling away, replaced by a sense of calm and contentment. 